Today I'm going to teach you the art of cooking. Everybody's staying home for months on end, trying new recipes, doing new things to make your family eat more, eat healthier. So do I have a dish for you? It is called spaghetti pie. Next time you decide that you want to have pasta, put two or three servings more in the pot. Cook it up. Put the rest in a bowl for your family to eat and take those two, three servings, put it back in the pot. So you've got hot pasta right now. You want to add two tablespoons of butter. Stir that all around till it's all coated. Add one egg. Stir that around so it doesn't cook. You want to make sure it covers the pasta. And then add a cup of Parmesan cheese. Okay? Stir that all up and now you have a crust. The crust will look like this. Put it in your pan or in your nine inch uh, pie pan and you're ready to put your ricotta cheese or your cottage cheese all on the bottom. So let's do that right now. So we have about eight ounces. Depends on how much your family likes cheese. Spread it all around like this. Wonderful. See? It's part of your pie. Now, you want to take your sauce. I had some leftover sauce. If you're cooking your pasta that night, you probably have hot sauce already. So, um, take your sauce and put it on top of the cheese. Spread it around. Just about to the edge of the crust, enough to cover the cottage cheese. Doesn't that look good? Now you'll be taking your mozzarella cheese, your white cheese, Monterey, whatever white cheese you want, and spread it all around, or just do what my grandma does. Use your fingers. Okay, so you're spreading it all around. It's starting to look like a pizza, doesn't it? Okay, next take your Parmesan cheese, your Asiago cheese. I think we're going to use Asiago today. And do a little more cheese. Always good to have cheese. And I like to put a little bit of Italian seasoning on top of it. Always have Italian seasoning on hand. Eh, not too much. I think I put a little too much there. About a teaspoon. Okay. You are ready. This is it. Now you can cook it right away in the oven, 350, about 35 degrees. Put it in the freezer. Actually have one all frozen up here. And you're ready to go. Mangiamo. Bye-bye.